Today, our dear country marks 60 years of freedom from colonial rule. As we mark this milestone, I wish to salute all Nigerians as we continue our efforts to build a country that matches the dreams and passions of the independence generation. Our national journey has been an uneven ride, with much to admire and plenty to correct. We have had triumph and tragedy, seen progress and reversals. But our country's profound potentials invite us to strive on, urging us to keep on the light of hope to quench the darkness of despair. As we confront our challenges, let us turn our gaze towards what we can become. We can be better than what we have ever been. The past 60 years offer lessons about what we can make of our country. Let us reflect on this to make the next 60 years an epoch of progress, success and development for our country and all its people. We can be the country that consistently guarantees equality of opportunity for every citizen, wherever they choose to live in this vast land. We have been at our best when we have upheld the rule of law and promoted merit. We must ensure that we have a strong framework for delivering decent public education and health systems. It is the people that we build in mind and body that can make real and sustainable the rich potentials of our country. We can make the hard choices we need to better secure and more closely connect all the parts of our country. Let us celebrate 60 years of independence with a focus on a new national consensus on our collective goals, on citizenship, on the rule of law and diversity, on merit, on governance, and how powers and responsibilities are devolved between the states and the federal government. In Kaduna State, we have tried in the last five years to contribute to national progress with reforms in governance, education, health, and infrastructure. We have strengthened our subnational economy with foreign direct investment and established strong credentials for ease of doing business. Our governance agenda aims to ensure that poverty does not stifle a child's ability to gain decent basic education and that young people have the skills and access to finance to actualize their agency in creating jobs or in doing well where they are employed. Through increased investments in the health sector, we seek to reduce the possibility that pregnancy becomes a fatal ordeal for mother and infant. We seek to stand by the hardworking and the honest, to promote initiative and to reward merit. Kaduna, like Nigeria, is a work in progress deserving of careful nurturing through ups and downs. It is in our hands to make the future better than the best of the past. We can do it. Happy Independence Anniversary.